Hello everybody, my name is Ryan M. Hughes, and this is an empathy map I made for a run shop business idea that I've had for about two months now. Um, there used to be a run store attached to my bicycle shop, and they had unfortunately had to move into a different community, and a lot of people have really been missing having a run shop locally, and I thought, well, it would be a great idea just to make a new run shop. And kind of capitalize on what they left behind. So that's the reason behind this empathy map. Let's dive right in. Going into the first slide here, we're going to talk about kind of what people are thinking and feeling currently. So people want a place to go where they can get a professional and educated opinion on what shoes they should wear for specific running needs. You know, not everyone just throws on a pair of shoes and go runs a mile. There's people who run trails. There's people who run marathons and street. There's people who run 5Ks. There's people who run 10Ks. There's people who run 50K trail races, 100 mile races. There's all different kinds of people who run out there. And there's all kinds of different shoes for those people. So basically, we just need to put the people with the shoes. And they're not getting that really online. So people want a place where they can meet other runners for group runs, race signups, and training. People want an experience that is better than purchasing shoes online as well. So going into our next slide, we're going to talk about what do people hear? Well, this is kind of goes over what influences people. So people are influenced by online reviews of shoes as well as advertisements. People are influenced by other friends and slash family members who run. People are influenced by runs that support a good cause or a charity. And people are influenced by seeing other runners in the community, whether that be in running, uh, running events in the community or just running in the community in general, out on trails or just running up and down the block. On our next slide, we're going to talk about what are people seeing. So people don't have a running store that is easy to get to right now. People see that the closest running store to the community is far away and its hours of operations make it even less accessible. People see that the closest running store to the community is in one of the most expensive neighborhoods in the community and has a higher cost due to its location. So going on to our next slide, we're going to talk about what people are saying about this. So people say they don't want to commute through traffic just to get a pair of shoes and just and are just buying shoes online instead. Um, just to put this in perspective, where the previous running store moved, you have to sit in about an hour of traffic to go about two to I think it's about two to four miles to the new running store. And it's just a little bit ridiculous. People are saying they miss having a local running store to come to to get advice and try shoes on before they buy them. Um, this is a big problem you see with people buying shoes online is, you know, they buy shoes, they get demotivated because they don't feel good on their feet. People are asking if the former local running store went out of business even though it just moved. Like, that's how isolated the former running store has become. It's, you know, a couple miles away now, but it's in a completely different community and people don't even really even know that it moved. So kind of the pains and the gains um, of the new running store would be, you know, the pains that people are having now are people don't have a close local store to try shoes on and get advice. People don't have a place to meet other people who run and sign up for races. And without professional advice, people are physically hurting themselves and stopping their running careers, which is really sad, ultimately. And now, the, kind of the gains of what would take place if we open a new run store would be people would have a local running store where they could try shoes, meet other runners, and learn about run events. And people will now have a professional opinion and advice on which shoe fits their individual need. And the biggest gain of all is more people can run. So that's my uh, little empathy map. I hope you guys all enjoyed. If you have any questions or anything of that nature, feel free to reach out at any time. Thank you.